All right, hello everyone. Coming at you with a new video. And this video is going to be about Hunter, the uh, TV series from the 80s. And it lasted uh, seven seasons when it was on, starring uh, Fred Dreyer and Stephanie Kramer. Uh, they're great in it. Uh, great chemistry between them. Great stories for back then. I mean, it's just a classic that you can rewatch over and over. And they're still showing them on reruns uh, today through streaming or whatever. But uh, VEI come out with the set here recently, and that's it right there. Um, but there, there's some caveats of it in that none of the episodes have been cleaned up or remastered. I think that VEI just used the Mill Creek uh, Masters that was used a few years ago. You see, they come out with season one and two, Mill Creek did, and then they put out the complete series. And the complete series went out of print, so it was a lot of money, and I couldn't afford it, so uh, I didn't have Hunter on DVD. So I only had seasons one and two. Well, when VEI come out with this for thirty nine ninety nine with free shipping, I can't turn that down because this was one of my favorite shows from the eighties. My sister absolutely loved it. Uh, I think she had a thing for Fred Dreyer, but I don't know. But uh, Stephanie Kramer for me, you know, was awesome and. Uh, you know, so I just naturally just took right to the show and, you know, uh, never missed a, a week of it when they showed new ones. There's 152 total episodes and then the TV movie. Um, VEI, I want to comment on the video quality first. And it's what you would expect uh, from, you know, just straight video to DVD. And not much was done. I mean, so... I think they look good. I think they have that natural, uh, original 80s look, the DVD look whenever they TV shows were first coming out. I know we're all used to HD, but, I mean, I kind of like the look uh, of non-HD sometimes, if you know what I mean. Uh, it's hard to explain. I guess it's a nostalgia thing. Uh, I've got a full-screen TV downstairs, so, you know, you go down there with a DVD player, pop one of these in, and it's like I'm watching it you know, from back in the 80s. I mean, that's, you don't get that when you put it on an HD TV and upscale it and move all that stuff. And plus, you know, when you upscale something that's meant for full screen TVs, it doesn't look that great anyway. So the best way to watch this is on a DVD player with about a 36 inch full screen TV, which is what I have downstairs. But anyway, uh, the packaging on this, that's the next thing I want to talk about. It comes with a nice slip box. And so far you're thinking, well, this is all well and good. But you cannot even open this with one hand. You have to use two hands. This is not the industry standard for uh, <laughs> putting out DVD releases. This box is not even the right size to fit on the shelf. Uh, as you can see, this is a normal one. And you've got about that much wider than a DVD case. So it's going to stick out a little more on your shelf, which kind of stinks. Plus, there's no trays in here. There's just uh, these plastic, uh, not plastic, uh, they're like a soft sleeve, uh, and it holds all 28. Each one has its own soft sleeve, but it's like, you know, you buy one of those little flip folders with, with and then just flip through them like a book. But, I mean, they're hard to get in and out. You're going to scratch them up. So, naturally, I'm not going to leave them in that. I can't even open this, so I'm not going to show you the inside. But it's a big, huge amount of plastic. Now, I took three 10-disc cases that I had ordered from a company that produces them. And I'm sitting here weighing them, weighing that. That plastic in that weighs a whole lot more. So, don't tell me you're saving the environment by not giving me flip trays. Uh, plus... Who wants to have to dig through all of that just to get to a certain one? And of course, there's no booklet in here. Nothing that tells about the episodes. That's another pet peeve. I like to have at least a listing on the inside jacket of the episodes and when they aired. And I like, really like a quick synopsis because that's how I can decide what episode I want to watch if it sounds interesting. You know, that's just common that TV on DVD releases should have is a little guide. I mean, if you can't do me a booklet, do it on the inside sleeve. VEI did nothing. I mean, you know, I know it cuts down the cost some, but they would sell so much more of them if they just put that little extra effort. You know, do the slip box, do the right size, 
put it in, uh, you know, the 10 disc clear cases and then do the synopsis of the episodes inside. How hard can that be? And it wouldn't have costed that much more. It wouldn't have. You know, not for the how heavy this, this plastic is very heavy. So don't tell me you're saving the environment by doing that. But anyway, this, I made my own custom covers and I did it in three volumes. So we have 10 discs in here, 10 in the second volume, and eight in the third volume. So a total of 28 discs. Now, yeah, mine's a little bit wider uh, than the actual release, you know, by about that much. You know, a couple of DVDs, maybe just one or two. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'd say about two DVDs sized right there. But, uh, you know, that's not that bad of difference, you know, in terms of shelf space. Plus, they're just so much better in these. And I'll show you what I mean. I just took the Season 1 cover, converted it, called it Volume 1. Season 2 cover, converted it. And then I found this one online. I think it's Season 4 cover. But uh, there's what they look like on the front covers. And then, of course, the spines are awesome. They look great on the shelf. Uh, let me just stand them up here. There we go. Nice shots of Fred Dreyer there. And then the backs are all different. That was one of the things I didn't like. But I just kept the same thing, theme on the backs that come with the originals from Mill Creek. There's volume one, volume two, volume three. Looks totally different. But that's okay. I, I really just love the fronts and being able to, you know, get, dig into them and easily get them out of the hub tray. Now I'm going to go over the DVDs. And each Mill Creek just used the same cover the same artwork on the, each one and just change the color so you know here's season one it's four discs season two four discs and then season three this is the first two discs and then it's continued on into volume two here so there's the rest of season three and we have season four you know a four disc set on each one of these they just kept it i think they're the same like i said the same mill creek release uh, that was a few years ago. Uh, here's season, is it five? And then there's four discs there. And then the last volume is eight discs. Season six, four discs. And here's di uh, season seven. Stephanie Kramer's not even in season seven, folks. Sorry to say, uh, she left the show. So season seven went down the drain and Hunter was canceled. You know, Fred Dreyer couldn't just do it on his own. It took Stephanie Kramer and that's how good she is. I mean, people didn't realize just how amazing she was in the show. She was my favorite in the show. Fred Dreyer was great. I mean, he couldn't play football for the Rams, but he could act. And I thought he did a phenomenal. It was just the chemistry between these two that was so good. And, you know, I just just love this series. And, uh, you know, as far as, as the you know, should I buy it? If you're even an inkling of a Hunter fan, you got to buy it. Uh, you're not going to get them in better quality, probably. I mean, you're not going to get a Blu-ray release. And those versions they're showing on streaming are not HD. They're just upscaled to these, and you can do the same on your, your TV because every TV and Blu-ray player will up, up them. If that's the way you prefer to see them, you know, you can do it that way. But, uh, you know, this is an amazing series, one I highly recommend. It's very hard-hitting and serious, uh, but it has the, this comedy factor between Hunter and Stephanie Kramer. And I love their uh, sergeant, too. So, anyway, uh, just wanted to show these custom cases that I made for it. Issue some rants about the VEI release. You know, I'm just glad they put it out. Don't get me wrong. But they need to work on the packaging and, uh, you know, the presentation of it uh, in terms of, you know, at least giving us a guide inside. Or, you know, if they had clear 10 disc cases and then did the guide in there, that would be perfect. You know, that's usually how most do it these days. But anyway, I guess Hunter wasn't worth it to them, you know, and they wanted to keep it as cheap as possible. So anyway, you see my solution to it. And I have to go to the Internet and get the episode guides. But, you know, I just look it up on my phone. I don't want to do that, you know, because, you know, if I ever decide to get rid of the Internet, I don't want to have to worry about, you know, having to go look up the guide. I guess I'll have to print it out if I want to do that. But anyway, so there's Hunter, the complete series by VEI and my custom cases. So until my next video, I'll be back.